What is going on guys? It is Schneider here and today we have him. We finally got him. Wayne Embry 95 overall from playing I think I I just got him around five minutes ago at the time of recording this video and I think I got him after like a hundred and five wins or something like that. No it was less than that. I don't know. That was so ra man, random number. It's probably like 95 wins, but <clears throat> man, I'm so happy because this card looks so good. He looks so good. And I mean, he's six foot eight, but he's got a seven foot three wingspan. And I know that from 2KDB. Uh, if you want to uh, know card stats and when they're coming out, um, go to 2KDB.net. You'll find out about all the cards there. That is not sponsored, I'm just telling you. It's good to know. So, 92 offense, 92 defense, 6 foot 8, but he feels probably like 6'10 with his wingspan. Um, 240 pounds. Uh, he's got a 92 driving layup. He's amazing in the post. He's got an 88 mid range, a 76 three ball with hot zones on both corners, so he's going to be hitting from both hot zones. 84 three free throw, 97 standing in driving which is very nice and 86 ball handling on his center also 85 block 85 still 83 burner and 90 interior 97 offensive and defensive rebounding and 86 speed 79 speed of ball 86 acceleration also 83 lateral quickness and the mental game is pretty good it's on point except for the shot IQ which is a little low but that doesn't really matter because I am taking the shots so he's got Hall of Fame Acrobat, Hall of Fame Relentless, Hall of Fame Box, Hall of Intimidator, Hall of Rebound Chaser, Hall of Worm, Hall of Contact Finisher, Hall of Deep Hooks, Hall of Giant Slayer, Hall of Fancy Footwork, Hall of Showtime, and Hall of Slithery Finisher. So he's got 12 Hall of Fame badges, which is, I think that's the most on a pink diamond this year. I could be mistaken though. Gold Catch and Shoot, Gold Corner Specialist, Gold Drop Stepper, Gold Rim Protector, Gold Clamps, Gold Heart Crusher, Gold Post Moved, um... Lockdown gold, uh, gold downhill gold pass like mushroom, gold quick for a step on the center, and gold brick wall. He can also get where is it range extender. So next gen, he's even better on current gen. He's still such a beast. The hot zones though outside the three are a little annoying, but current gen that doesn't matter as much. But this card, oh my gosh, you saw those stats, and I just got him like five minutes ago so let's let's go into freestyle and try him out all right so we've got wayne embry here and he does look a lot taller than six foot ten to be honest um as you see his hot zones he has two outside the three in the corners i mean he'll be hitting occasionally from like the wings in the top of the key but he's not going to be hitting consistently where he's going to be hitting consistently is the corners. And as you can see, the jumper, I mean, it's not the best, but it's definitely not the worst. Like, for a center, it's nice. It's definitely usable. It's like, I don't know what it is, to be honest. I've never seen his release on another card. But, I mean, you're not going to be shooting threes. That's not his specialty. But he, if he goes to the corner, he's going to be hitting. Because he's got gold corner specialist. He does not have hot zone hunter. So he's not going to be hitting automatically. But with a coach shoe. Um, and floor general dimer. He's going to be hitting. So he's got hot zones everywhere. Inside the three point line. Which is nice. So he's going to be not missing from the mid range. He's got. Um, not Giannis behind the back. Which is normal too. But he's got gold quick for step. And look at those dunk animations. He's got a standing and driving dunk, and all around a beast of a card from what it looks like. And um, as you can see, running down the court, he's fast, and like he's got pretty good sigs for uh, center, and I really hope I get next gen soon. Um, it's not restocking, but I really need to get that soon. But yeah, this card overall just looks so good. Um, like, he's athletic, he's making insane dunks, and overall beast of a card. So let's make a three, uh, green it preferably. 
There we go. So let's play some TTO. All right, so we have matched up against Sean Kemp, Dana Barros, and Gerald Green. I do want to get that Dana Barros, and it's only 10 wins, which is does not seem that hard, but he looks like a very good card. Sean Kemp is also very nice, and he's like 4,000 MT, and Gerald Green's not the best. So I think we've matched up against uh, Sean Kemp, is it? Yeah. So Sean Kemp is actually a pretty good card. So I want to just try and pick and feed, see if, yeah. You gotta guard up. You gotta guard up on Wayne in the mid E because he is not missing from there. What I really need to try out, I mean, his I mean, his defense looks absolutely amazing. That is not going in. As Darren Fox gets the rebound, and look how fast this Darren Fox is. Is he gonna back away? I want him, I want him to back away. Ah, just drive by him. And we dunk it on him. Good good dunk, Wayne. This card is crazy athletic. I can't really paint it on Sean Kemp, though I really could if I really wanted to, but this guy is spamming Gerald Green. Let's get it to, oh, drive, dunk it on him. And we can't score on Gerald Green, it's fine, but we're getting the rebound and dunking it on him. Well, Hoff rebound chaser on him is very nice. Um, quick 6 nothing lead here. I think this guy's just spamming. Joe Green, maybe for challenges, I don't know, but let's get that behind the back, and then right by and making the layup. Good shot there by Wayne Embry. Um, I'll see, we'll try paint standing. If he makes a three, then, yeah, he's not going to be hitting. Um, if he's shooting like that, let's try a snatch back. I don't know why I'm doing this, but yeah, he does not have a hot zone there, so I don't know, he's not going to be making there. And he's fouling. Okay. You know what? Look at those stats. A plus A, A, A. <laughs> he's an all-around player. I'll tell you that. That was a bad play by me. Um, Up 8-2 to two here early in the game. To start it out, man, this card looks freaking amazing. So I want to see him back away because I really want to shoot a 3 with him. Honestly, let's try it. Well, let's try it. Why not? And he hits it. Wayne Embry hitting the white from the three-point line. I think that De'Aaron Fox might have dimer. That is not going in. Ah, not getting the rebound. Sean Kemp is slightly taller. Um, as he greens that shot there. Um, up 11 to 4. Um, let's get it to Wayne. And look how fast he is. He's so fast. Gold quick for step on him too, man. He's unreal. Yeah, I don't know what this guy's doing to be honest, but um, cross, cross, dunk it on him, dunk it on him, Wayne Embry. Oh my gosh, this card. Um, that's a steal. Oh, that's got to be a steal. Just play defense. He's only using Gerald Green. Um, come on, no way. Get that rebound. Jalen Brown, thanks for the rebound. Uh, let's, and then just drive. Uh, why is he not running? It's fine. It's fine. We're dunking it. 17 and 4 with Wayne Embry, and we are up 17 to 4. As Gerald Green hits a 360 dunk. I think this guy's just doing challenges, so. Uh, not the toughest opponent. Um, come on. Cross and blow by. And is, if that went in, oh my gosh. But Wayne Embry gets the rebound and dunks it. Oh my gosh. Um, yeah, this is the most fun I've probably had using a card all year. Uh, I'm just going to keep painting. Let him shoot it. He's honestly, like, better Sean Kemp. Really, in theory, so that's what he is. As we're getting the rebound with De'Aaron Fox. This De'Aaron Fox card is nice. I need to do challenges, as I have no idea what I'm doing there. Um, and Sean Kemp dunks it. We just need one more basket to win. So let's get it to Wayne Embry here and drive. Just freaking drive on them. And we won 21-8 to here. 21-5 with Wayne Embry. We're going into another game. Let's go.
All right, so we have matched up against Tyler Hero, Antoine Walker, and LeBron. So this guy has got an Antoine Walker. So he's won a quite a bit of games, but he does not have a center, and he does not have a clamps player unless he put it on um, Tyler Hero. And I don't believe Antoine Walker has clamps, but on LeBron James here, as he um, Jalen Brown gets a steal for us, get in the post, and just abuse, abuse. Wayne Embry. So, NBA preseason has started, and I assume within, probably within when the season starts, um, that is horrible defense by me. Uh, we're going to get moments of the week cards, and they are probably going to be good. So, hopefully my Boston Celtics will play well. Um, just get in the post, and I thought I was going to run out of bounds there, but um, I have started recording NMS4, or Budget Squad. Uh, so that should be out soon <laughs> as Wayne Embry between the legs dunks it on LeBron James. That is just disrespectful. Um, I've never heard of Wayne Embry as he's getting the rebound over LeBron. Um, can we get another? Oh my gosh. This card. So standing up next to LeBron, I mean, they look like the same height, but um, he feels like a big man. <laughs> He feels like a very good big man as we're snatching. If we hit that, if I hit that shot, I would have been amazed. But um, as uh, LeBron gets the dunk. Um, so, yeah, uh, this is probably the best free card they've released in a long all year. They've like, well, he's probably the like Curry, Blake Griffin and then this card. That's probably how it ranks. But get that rebound. Hall of Fame rebound chaser. Honestly, why not? Let's try it. And we miss it. Ah, I thought I timed that well, but it's fine. I don't expect him to be hitting constantly from three, as I thought I played good defense there, but I guess not. It is tied at eight. Probably should not be taking as many threes as I am, but let's just get it to Wayne. Just get it to Wayne Embry and run. And he actually, LeBron gets a good kid test on that. Um, this guy is not a bad player. I'm just going to say that now. And Antoine Walker is left wide open. He does miss it. And let's get it to Wayne Embry. Um, let's take it back. That's ISO. It's Tyler Hero. Oh, why did I pick up my dribble? Um, yeah, go paint it. And an and one by Wayne Embry. Oh my goodness. Um, I never make those. Somehow Wayne makes it. Oh my goodness. He's going to shoot that. I already knew that. And we are getting the rebound. And run. Run and dunk it on him. Wayne Embry. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Um. No, 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 wait. Oh, that's my fault. I should have got that, and I am jumping for no reason, and LeBron hits the 20% contested layup. Up 12-2, I feel like I'm up by a lot more for some reason, I don't know why, but I can't get too ahead of myself, because I know this guy's not bad, as we make another dunk with Wayne Embry. Let's see if we can hit a three. See that? Ah, come on. Come on, play defense. Let LeBron shoot. Let LeBron shoot. That's Ruby LeBron. Snatch. Oh, go quick for a step. Look how fast he is. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. This card. Is he out of here? No, nope, he's still here. I thought he. I thought he. Thought he had to log off off of that after that. But all right, shoot it. Yeah, no way. You're kidding. He actually hit that. Okay. Well. Um, it's fine. Just drive on him. Just get in the post. Wayne Embry with the slam. That was the weirdest dunk animation or standing dunk animation I've seen. Um. All right. Um. He's I I I'm spamming my Y button this year for some reason. Um. Honestly, I kind of want to get a three to end it. But it's a Wayne Embry gameplay. No, he's left me wide open. I can't pass that up. As I'm missing that. Uh, okay. It's fine. 
as we get the steal, get it to De'Aaron. Ah, uh, nah. I don't know what I'm doing, to be honest, but Wayne Embry with another slam dunk. Okay. Yeah. Um, yeah, th this is just, this is unbelievable. Um, but come on. I gotta stop hitting why, because I know he's just gonna keep pump faking on me, but. Um, get it to Wayne and hop step. And I get blocked by Tyler Hero. Nice. Um, he wants to get to Tyler. Oh, that's a steal. I hit X right as he passed it. All right, Tyler. Yeah, no. He's airballing it. Hall of Fame intimidator, all intimidator in gold clamps. Yeah, you're not. You're not gonna do much on offense against him and that is a bad play by me I thought it, if he posterized him there that would have been amazing he's cold no way and he actually it's it right, I need to win this game to be honest let's just get it to uh, and I get stuffed Wow still my ball though um, let's just end it here I don't I actually want to win this game so pass it back Catch it. Come on. Come on, Wayne. Green Bean. We end up winning the game by three points. Let's get back to the menu and talk about him. All right. So as you saw from those two games, man, this card is unreal. This card is unreal. This is the best card I've used all year, and it's not even close. It is not even close. I mean, the way this card moves for his position and... I didn't really use him in the post that much, but he's got a 95 post hook and post. It was an 88 post fan, like 92 driving layup. He's unbelievable. He's so fast for his position. He's got very good defense. I don't think his only stat that is in the 70s or below 80 is his three point shot, but with a shoe and a coach, that's like an 82. His um, pass IQ and pass accuracy, um, that doesn't really matter. Pass accuracy is slow, but it's a big man, so. His defense, his lowest stat is an 83 for a perimeter, and that's for a uh, center. He's got m pretty much maxed out rebounding, and the speed, 79 speed with the ball, but if you have a right coach, then he's above in the 80, a 79 speed with the ball, or you put a shoe on him. So, I honestly might put my one of my diamond shoes on him. So, is there a speed with ball shoe? I kind of want a three-pointer and speed with ball. So, if this Puma Sky, whatever it, whatever it is, um, what is it, a Puma shoe? Um, if it's going for a lot, I might sell. Yeah, it's not going for a lot. I can always buy another one. So, I think I'm going to apply the shoe to uh, Wayne Embry. So, let's go here. not as good as Blake Griffin, but he's, like, not far behind him, because, like, I mean, I don't, I've never used Blake Griffin, so I, I can't tell you if he's better or not, but I think he's better, because I've seen people use him, and I've played against him, but this is probably the closest card you're getting to a Blake Griffin kind of card, and to be honest, if, if you have the time to do this, I wouldn't have on real and I played let's see how many games did I play? I think did he come out when the Phil Chenier came out? 82 games, um I've seen people get them a lot earlier. But if you have the time to do it, do it because this is by far my favorite card in the game. He's just amazing. So I think that's pretty much it. Um uh, out of 10, he's a 9.5 for me. Um, with a better 3-pointer, he'd be like a 10. But I did put a shoe on him, so I think that is going to be it. Um, like I said before, do it. You do have, let's see, 16 days at the time of recording this video to get him. So, highly, highly, highly recommend to get him. So.
So, like the video, subscribe to the channel, and tell your friends about it. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.